When it comes to goal setting, you need to be ready to bridge the gaps to really get your skills up and embrace that challenge. In this video, I'm gonna be going over a few ways you can start to change your mindset and really reach out for those goals and grab them. Let's get into it. So if you aren't challenging yourself, you are gonna be stagnating. I don't want you to compare yourself to your peers. I want you to compare yourself to you. And so if you're not setting challenging goals and pushing yourself to be better than you were before, you're stagnating. And even worse, if you're stagnating, is you're probably bored too. And being bored at work is not great. You really wanna be looking for those gaps in your resume coverage to where you can really go start making yourself marketable. It could be to the same firm that you're at, the same company, and really find a spot where you can get that promotion that you're after, move to a different group, something that truly aligns with your goals personally, that you have really deep intrinsic motivation for, and every person is different. By filling those gaps in your resume and your capabilities, this is gonna allow you to find that thing that really fires you up. If you found it already, why aren't you challenging yourself to do better with it? If you have your fire, stoke the fire. So I, I guess that just sounds crazy to me when you walk through the lodge like that. If you haven't found your thing yet, keep trying new things until you do. And once you find your thing, lean into that thing. Because if you aren't challenging yourself, you're not growing. And if you're not growing, you're stagnating. What do you think? Where are you holding yourself back? You should drop me a comment below because I would love to hear if you know what your thing is, and what's holding you back from doing more of it and growing in your skills and capabilities. To keep going and not stagnate in your career, you should press on with this IQ playlist up here. Or if you're ready to move to emotional intelligence or EQ, you can get started with that playlist right down here. Or keep doing exactly what you're doing and getting exactly the same results that you've been getting.